Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can update your iPad OS to iPad OS 13 uh, beta. So this is a beta version only. Um, it's it's more uh, if you want to test it out, try it out, and see if you like it or not. So here's how you can update it. So I'm just gonna show you how you can update it. And uh, what you want to do is uh, first plug your iPad to the computer. So I've got the USB cable here, I'm plugging it and you need to download the tools called Tree U Tools. So download that tools and plug the iPad into the computer. Once that software is installed, plug in your iPad to the computer. And uh, these tools will uh, pick up your iPad. Uh, you probably need to give a trust permission on your iPad for that to work. So now you can see here, if I go into about, you can see over here it shows that I'm running version 11.3 so on your tools on your 3u tools um, it will give you some information about your ipad you want to click on flash over here flash and jb click on that and down here it show you a list of the all the firmware you can install into your ipad now on the right hand side here there is a download button so you can download the actual file directly from these tools here so just click on the download button if you haven't got one click on the download buttons otherwise you also could click on the import button if you've got the IPSW file already downloaded so somewhere onto your computer now if you haven't got one you can click on the download buttons and that will make it a piece of cake very easy all you have to do is just click on the download and wait and the download is really fast now I have already downloaded the file so that makes things faster uh, I'm just going to click on the flash button down here so click on flash then I'll click on flash again now before you uh, flash your iPad, make sure that you back up all your data onto the computer using iTunes or using the, this software directly uh, in the case that um, if something goes wrong well, as you know this is a beta version only so if something goes wrong you can always uh, back uh, restore your data back to your iPad or if later you don't really like the software you at least you can back uh, you can restore your data so once you have back up all your data just uh, click on the flash button and then uh, so if my iPad is turned on, if you don't have an Apple ID account or password uh, of this device, you can't activate the i the, the i device after the flash. Uh, that's fine. I just click on yes because I do have the the password to the account, so I will sign in after it finish uh, flashing the device. Now you can see here it is uh, extracting the firmware. So we we'll wait for a while until it flashes. This is the iPad 2017. And we'll wait for that to finish and I'll show you the final finished product once the flash is done. At this point here, um, there's nothing much we can do. We just have to wait for it to finish. So uh, I'll just let that finish for now. Now you will see your iPad will go into uh, a reboot mode and it will go into a recovery mode. And then it will uh, reboot again with an Apple logos. And you will notice that uh, later there will be a progress bar right here. And that means it's just uh, updating the software. So you wait, you have to wait for a few minutes for this to complete. The whole process itself uh, doesn't take very long, probably between five to 10 minutes. And you'll be able to running uh, the new iPad OS 13 beta on your device. Okay, so shortly you should see it say, congratulations, we turned data flash completed. So I'm just gonna, on my iPad, I'll press on the home button to upgrade. So I need to put in the iPad uh, passcode if you got one. And then I'll put in the passcode and then it say, press home to recover. So I press on the button. And again, I need to put in my passcode once more. So I need to put once more to confirm, to verify, and it's attempting data recovery. So we'll wait for that to finish and see what happens. Okay, the process of uh, attempting recovery data can take some time. And uh, here it is. So now I need to put in the passcode uh, to gain access to the iPad. So it's an update completed and I tap on continued. And I'm just gonna go through here. So after steps, so I'll just add setup later. So 
So if we go back here, you can see now it got uh, light mod and dark mod. So if I choose that mod and I tap on continued and continue, continue, and that's it. So now let's check the software update settings. And about and down here you can see um, it's running uh, software version 13 now. Now they move it up to the top, and it's even got the model name here iPad 5th generation and model number and serial number. So there it is. Uh, that's the uh, dark mode. So if you go to displayed, so I'm just gonna find displayed. Uh, displayed in brightness down here and in here we can choose between light mode and dark mode on your iPad and you got the automatic uh, changes right there you can also change the brightness as well down here you got night shift uh, sunrise to sunset and other options as well so that's on the iPad you can uh, also tell by uh, pressing on the volume key uh, on the iPad, on the iPad here, there it is, and you can see it also pops up on a as a slider right there. And uh, this that's the new uh, update to iOS of the sorry the iPad OS 13 uh, on your iPad. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.